Hey guys, today we are going to see if red turn heads. Let's go. Okay guys, let's get the show on the road. Do not mind my nail situation. When I come back, I'ma be popping. So, Mega Look Hair is what we got today. I just reviewed for them. It was a blonde wig. It was the same wig my daughter had. Well, anyway, this is the same company. This and one other company are the only two companies I do dedicated hair reviews for now. So yeah, you won't be seeing many of these, but this is what you get in the bag. It's a pink pouch. Off inside of here, there are lashes. Oh, look at the cute head scar. For those days, your fonts are lifting a little bit. <laughs> um, a pink clip. Edge brush slash comb. And stocking caps, and the darker brown stocking caps. So let's get into what we got. They say 22 inches. Look at, look at her. Look at her, honey. Look at her. I'm about to be hot to try for real. Oh, I love the way they make their wigs. It is a um, frontal wig, okay? The knots are bleached. The knots are bleached. Let's turn it. There's already adjustable strap in here, so we can make this glueless. Two adjustable straps at the back with a comb. And you have three, two on the side and one in the middle. So this is pre-plucked and it is bleached. I haven't used this camera in so long, guys, so. I'm just going to put it on. I already put the stocking cap on, obviously. And, oh, girl. <laughs> they, they tried to lead me. And see what we're working with. The fit and everything. Man, I'm going red, red. Okay, so. so. Okay. So, let's cut the lace off. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy, but I don't even have a mirror in here. For real, be right. So the fit is a little big. I can tell that by how loose it feel on my head. So I'm still gonna just cut the lace on my head. I was gonna keep this glueless, but I am gonna have to adhere it a little bit because it's a little big. So I'm just taking some very tiny scissors that you can get from like the beauty supply and cutting this lace. So I am gonna have to tint this lace cause girl, it's like invisible. It's supposed to be invisible, but it's like a clear, and it's going to show. All right, guys, so I went and got my Got To Be Glue. This is like the bootleg edition. Ain't no professional over here, okay? And I'm going to go ahead and put this around my perimeter and let this be drying while I um put some makeup on the inside of this wig. That's what I'm going to do. Just like that, that simple. I am taking my Fenty Beauty Stick, and this is the one in Latte. And I'm just gonna turn it, my wig like this, and go for it. You guys can see that. See, it's turning the color more my color. That's what I want. I am gonna set that concealer with my Estee Lauder Double Wear in Amber Honey. Move fast, honey, before this gel 
completely dry and you just dip it dip it dip it I'm using a big brush so it'll get a lot of area at one time and just literally set it now I wish this band was a little tighter I got the adjustable bands at the back tight as they'll go let's see what's working out here and then I'm just gonna adhere this yeah no this wig is way too big for me we're gonna have to cut some stuff way 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 too big first of all I don't even want it back I don't even want it on my forehead like that So what I'm going to have to do is cut some of this ear tab off. It's just way too much. My head ain't that big. It's covering my ear. See? It'll cover my whole ear. And I hate when I have to do this because it causes shedding to me. Girl, if it's too big, it's too dang big. That's I'm literally gonna take like this rag. I love this, it don't slip or anything. It's kind of dirty. And just do this for like 10 minutes until this set. 10 minutes. All right guys, so I'm back with the most of my beat. Sis put her nails on. So I'm just gonna take this off. I always have to take this off anyway because my makeup line um, to see if I want baby hair and what all I'm gonna do. Still looking a little white. So I'm so glad I did that because I need to go back in and adjust this some more. So, you see? Do I want baby hairs? Let me put some baby hairs in it. Just a little bit. So I did add baby hairs, but you guys see that all the time, right? So I'm going back in with my face powder because, baby, the Rihanna Foundation trying to sabotage me a little bit. And I did not part the wig at all. I just did the little, um, the little flip over. Not flip over, but, you know, little method. And I think... Sorry guys, my ones are, they always want to pop open right here. I think I want to put some curls at the front. So I'm just going to take a barrel curl and do that. At first I was like, we can't go red sis. You look a little, a little clownish, but I just had to maneuver it and work with it a little bit. I'm not a pro, but <laughs> I can make it work. Guys, I promise I didn't do nothing spectacular off camera, but curl right here and pinned it curl right here and pinned it about a little bit of hair like that I'm gonna just take some coconut oil if you can see I already started over here I'm just gonna rub it in my hands good and put it over here too that way it don't look all stringy and all over the place I don't want it to look oily either so not that much I look a little pin up ish huh there's almost no shedding in this hair it's a little bit but when I was cutting the lace off the back of the wig, I did cut the hair a little bit. So that's probably why it's not actually coming from the hair. It's coming from that. So I'm just going to tie it back up and finish my makeup. Maybe they say red turn heads. We about to see the night. <laughs> So guys, this is what we have. Let me stand up so you guys can see the length. It's a good little length, okay? I will leave the link to this hair, the direct link, right below the video along with a discount code. Let me know if you like me in this spread hair, okay? I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye!